So what we're going to do this evening, broadly speaking, yeah. so Morris Curie, where are you going? I don't want to sit next to Jackie from Kenya. What's going to say? I know Jackie. Yeah. Okay. As you can see, some of our artists are less well behaved than others. Watch out for Ice Prince. He's got a very naughty side. And as for Ali Kiba, we haven't managed to stop him being mischievous the last two days. Okay, so broadly speaking, um, I'm not going to introduce the press conference, but I'll talk about Coke Studio. When do you want me to do that? Okay, right. Okay, great, fine. Okay, great. Let's talk a little bit about Coke Studio for a moment. Coke Studio is now through in its third season. Um, this year we have five countries Nigeria, they're all on the stage Nigeria, Mozambique, Kenya, Uganda, and Tanzania. We've been very proud to say that Coke Studio has been growing significantly in its first two seasons, and season three is extremely exciting. The big change in season three, apart from the fact that the stage looks even better than last year, is that this season is embraces the idea of mashups. What a mashup is, Mr. Music Director, I'm allowed to say, am I allowed to, allowed to talk about this? Yes? So that's why Bala, by the way, he's quite famous as well, actually. You may know. And I'd like to introduce him separately, please. Can you please come up so I can introduce him before oh, I talk oh. about this? We're delighted to have a new music director this year. Zwai Bala is a <laughs> South African gentleman. For any of you that remember the band that changed Kwaito, Mr. Zwai Bala is the Z in TKZ. He also runs Bala Brothers Productions, and with his two brothers, Luiso Bala, the top R&B artist in South Africa, and Pero Bala, they are a phenomenal triumvirate who you'll see very shortly breaking in big time to America. So I would you like to say something briefly before I talk about the mashups? Like, hello. Oh, okay. <laughs> hello everybody, Sandy Bonani, Mandomba Zanana Manene. My name is Zwai Bala, as he said, uh, uh, nearing the end of shooting uh, and working at Coke Studio Africa, it's been a delight. Many challenges which I've learned from. Uh, and it's been absolutely phenomenal working with all the wonderful talent. Love meeting new people from different countries on the continent. And uh, I've learned a lot and I've got uh, great musicians to work with. And great yeah. Jobs. Great jobs. Got great jobs. Yeah, you guys are funny. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Okay, great. I'm going to talk about the mashups briefly. Okay. So just in season three, really, just to understand how season three is going to work, this is the first time is we're introducing the concept of the mashup. That means we put two artists together, we take one artist's song, we take a second artist's song, we give it to a producer, and the producer creates a third song. For the first time in Coke Studio, audiences will be engaged through voting. We decided to create, for the first time in Africa, a Coke Studio album, compilation album. That album will feature 10 to 12 of the best songs on this season, and viewers will be able to vote by posting, liking, sharing, viewing, SMS to Twitter, I believe, is also involved. Uh, online, there are 48 hours to do that. It's a key point in this year's show. And that's in direct response to the amount of uh, email we get, the commentary we get about, we want the music. So this year, for the first time, all of our consumers that watch the show will have the opportunity to take the music and be able to listen to it on any kind of media they would like. We have 26 artists this year. We have five of Africa's finest superstars on the stage tonight. Um, do you want to do introductions? Or you're going to do that. Then. Okay, so I'm not allowed to do introductions. Okay, fine. So I'm going to pass you back. If there's any questions, I'm around. If there's any confusion, I'm around. Okay. Thank you, David. Uh, so I'll take this very grand opportunity to welcome Neil on stage. So please put your hands together for Neil. <laughs> Much better, much better, much better. Okay, okay, so we're gonna set the ball rolling immediately because we don't have a lot of time. Uh, we're very glad that you're all here. Thank you for your time and company. I thank the artists too because they've been here since 7 a.m. and they're still looking bright and you know, shiny. My name is Aniko, I work for the um, publicist of this show and I will um, allow my colleague Laura to do the main introduction. Okay, welcome once again for the Superstar Connect session. We've been having a couple of this in the past few weeks. Some of you have been very faithful to attend, and thank 
you for finding time to join us again, especially for the big one. So um, David has already given him his address. He has talked about what we've been up to and basically the mashup concept. So we're going to move into the introduction of the artist. So when you go to the uh, basically just a short brief of the artist who we have today. So like David mentioned, Talk City Africa has this year, you know, uh, worked with 26 artists from five different countries. That is Kenya, Tanzania, Uganda, Mozambique, and Nigeria. And uh, five select artists from these regions um, have been chosen, and you're looking at the chosen few. So I will take this opportunity to briefly introduce them. Of course, the first one right here is Zwai Bala, the music director of the show. We have, oh, plus. <laughs> <laughs> We have Maurice Kiria from Uganda, Woo! and uh, he's the king of soul and R&B in East Africa. Yes. We, yeah, you agree? Yes. Yes. We have Dama Dobling, the coolest Woo! chick from Mozambique, Woo! and uh, she represents hip hop mad. Like when she raps and performs on stage, you go crazy. And then give it up for the girl. Woo! We have the king Kiba. Yeah! <laughs> One of the most respected music writers from East Africa, a masterful songwriter and singer. We love him so much. Kiba, welcome. <laughs> then uh, on the other side, we have the baddest rapper from Nigeria. <laughs> yeah, ice cream. When he's not taking selfies with Jay Z, he's at Coke Studio Africa. Yeah. yeah. And then I'm going to skip Vivian and go straight to Wangeshi. She represents Kenya. <laughs> And uh, she's undoubtedly the fastest rising from C. So watch out for her. She's going to be killing it on the new season of Cox Studio Africa. Give it up to her. <laughs> and then last but not least is the American singer and songwriter Neo. You probably know him from um, the biggest hits that you ever had from you know 2007. We're talking about um, sexy love. When you're mad, you're mad. Um, Woo! it's Woo! been 10 years. Woo! It's been 10 years. It doesn't look like 10 years, but it's been 10 years since Neo has six albums to date. His latest album is called Nonfiction and was released this year. Go to Bill, uh, uh, Hot Billboards and see. It's doing very well. So we're really glad uh, that Neo is right here in Kenya. He's here. <laughs> He's here as a special star guest of Coke Studio Africa Season 3. And if you don't know what, uh, what's really going to happen is that Neo is recording a song with the five African superstars. So um, it's, a, it's a big year for Neo. His new album is out and he's on Coke Studio Africa. He's also going to be working on a couple of other shows. So um, let me hear a grand welcome for Neo. Woo! 